Now you're very welcome back to What Matters programme and I'm here in Eskeaton in County Limerick with Billy Maguire, President of the Irish Republican Brotherhood. Um, welcome back of course to part two. Um, Billy, now here is a very important memorial to local men yes. who took part during the struggle, the years of the struggle, 1919 to 1921. That's the war of independence. That's the war. So you're going to actually read out, well, because they're all yes. local people. They're all local people. And the first person we have is Jared Don Morn. <coughs> He's Main Street, Askeaton. Thomas Blackwell. You have Terence Ryan. Thomas Ryan. Thomas Ryan. Jack Fitzgerald. James Collins. And Pat Kennelly. Michael Murphy, Jack Cosgrave, yep. William Fitzgerald, Jack Fitzgerald, Sean Cregan, Cregan. Tom Wallace, and Morgan Crow. Yes. Now these were all local men who fought in the war. Fought in, in the war of in, in and also Jim Sheehy of uh, Bally uh, Bally Yellen, imprisoned in Mount Joy. A jail in 1920-21. But these were all local men whose offspring, I'm sure, are yeah, still living in the Esquite area today. Yes. And I think it's lovely to read them out, well, I Billy, do. and that's to remember them. That's what it's them. all about, Easter. Yes. That's yes. what we should be remembering. Yes. And, we, and they were the ones who... Uh, uh, Dahl Aaron, you hear about Dahl Aaron. Yes. Dahl, these were the <clears> ones... <throat> everything was to put up Dahl Aaron. Yes. And to establish Dahl Aaron. And then, as we said, the 1918-32 county election, that is the conflict still. From here it's we still are, going on. A hundred years. Yes. And Britain will not recognise the democratically wishes of the sovereign Irish people. And that is an absolute scandal in this day and age. And we've discussed before about the peace, reconciliation and prosperity process. That is what it was about. Yes. And it was Pope Pius XII that founded the Peace, Reconciliation and Prosperity process. And Monsignor Hugh O'Flaherty, he was, yes. the, he was the, the strong man in the Vatican. He certainly time. was. We have two uh, uh, embassies. We have the Free State one is in Rome, but the sovereign one is in the Vatican. The Vatican, yes. And all the, the diplomatic corps in the Vatican, they had to have a sovereign dollar in, because sovereignty comes from God. Yes. That's where sovereignty comes from. And it's one thing, uh, uh, but uh, the, uh, we, as we said, corporations and that, they're only, they're, they're man-made yes. to make money. And what they have caused the world today, you, you can see it, it is scandalous. It is, yes. And people should know where they come from. And look at those people, they knew exactly what they were doing. They, they gave their lives for Ireland. Uh, that we would have a sovereign dollar in government. You'd own your house and your land, and we'll see that in the sovereign constitution, which we will also read. And I think it's very important for people to understand where Irish people come from. And now, I, Billy, you're going to lay a, a lovely, yes, nice a private lily. ceremony. You're laying an Easter lily. It's, it's a bit small, John, because they're only just out. Yes. But still, look, I think it's better to do it. I agree. And it's the green, white and orange. The stamen yes. is orange. And look, there you have it there. And, and, uh, Very nice. Well, we'll go in and, and uh, lay that. I think here is appropriate. I here. think it is lovely, yes. Lovely. Now we're going over here then to another uh, monument, beautiful stonework actually. It is gorgeous. And, and you're they going they to read this out for us now, Billy, as well. Era, and that's, we know, the Sovereign Republic <coughs> of Era with the father on top. Yes. And it has to have that underneath the Sovereign Seal to make it legal, valid or bona fides. I see. And if you look at the Free State, they're not allowed to use that because they're under the Crown. Ah. Uh. And yes. that's, that's on your passport, that's the 21st of January. And it comes from that 1918-32 county election. Era. Era. And that's what Era, and that's what 1155 from Pope Adrian IV, illegally and fraudulently gave the Hibernia, which is Era, 
to Henry II to build his empire. That is the conflict today. That's the, it's still going on. Still that is on. the it's essence of it. Yes. And then we had Henry VIII. Uh, uh, he, he fell out with the Pope. So uh, he turned the uh, um, Britain, the, the monarchy, yes. into a corporation to make money. And they went all over the world and they robbed and plundered because plundered. they didn't have to Conquered. respect yes. uh, the sovereignty of other countries, yes. the sovereignty of people, the sovereignty of God. They didn't do that. And that's for today. So you're going to read this out here, Billy? Well, it's the role of honour. Lovely. Captain Petty O'Neill, Belly North, United Irishman, executed 1798. Captain Turns Morn. Uh, Alalaka. Alalaka. White boy. White, he was a white boy. They were a, a yes, that's right. organisation. Yes. He, I, I remember those Morns well. They're still here. Uh, killed in action 1821. And Lieutenant Dan Neville. Bally Agnish. Bally Agnish. Irish Republican Army. That's the IRA. Killed in action 1920. And we have to salute those people. Yes, we do. People. You know, without these people, we wouldn't have our independence. No, we would not. We wouldn't be able to have a hope. God that. knows where, and, where we'd be today even without these great men and women. We'd be in, you can see the way the world is going. We have our sovereignty and we believe in God. Yes. That's what we do. And it's the old Celtic Christianity which is there and there's the castle there behind it. Now there's another uh, script here which is very important as well. Uh, just behind this uh, beautiful stonework. It was erected in 2016 and it's you, you, if you read that out, I Billy, there, it. <laughs> it says 1798 to 1921. Right. In memory of the brave men and women from the parish of Askeaton and Ballysteen who contributed to the struggle for Irish freedom. Many suffered, suffered so that someday all Irish people may know justice and peace. Keyboard. Theobald uh, uh, Wolftone. Uh, you know, it's wonderful. Theobald uh, Wolftone. And erected in, in, in 2016. This garden was, was erected in 2016. Beautiful. The 100th anniversary of the 1916 rising. Well, we have to thank, I, I, you know, there's so many people involved in Eskeaton here, even yes. from the church Isn't as well. Wonderful. Well done. Wow. Oh, congratulations, congratulations to all I of just them. Look, look at the size there. Look yes. Look at the size, John. It's, it is. It's small, it's compact, it's beautiful, and it's enough. we're just looking over there. Is that that's the castle then? Yeah, very and, important. And then behind us then is the, the friary. Yes, the friary is just down here. Yes. And have those all in one place. And to have them here, and there's the beautiful river coming down. Isn't that lovely? It is. Magnificent. Oh, the people of Askeet, they're so lucky. Yes. You know? Yes. Absolutely fantastic. And this is so important. We mentioned about Christopher Columbus coming here. We did, yes. For information of the Brendan voyage. He couldn't have gone to America without that, all that knowledge and technology. And that comes from Loch Gore. And this is um, the deal, and this is uh, the Earl of Desmond. And that was his territory. These were the universities in those days. We're yes. going back. You, you know, to that time. And hundreds of years. Oh, hundreds of years. But they had us, they had the information and knowledge. And we said, look, there's a, a wonderful day. Look at the light and shade there. Mm -hmm. You know, how you measure mathematics, science, you know, astrology, everything comes from here. And we have it. And people don't know anything about it. They're not taught anything about it. Well, they're certainly learning through you. Well, Nationally no. and internationally well, as well. The, there's our, the flags are up. Yes. Uh, it's lovely to see. It is. Uh, and that's the European one. And our one, the green part of North. Uh, and when, when Thomas Francis Marr brought that in, it was orange, white and green. And yes. the IRB changes, and as we said the other day, uh, for uh, James Stevens' funeral yes. in 1901. They wrapped it around his coffin. So we know where it comes from. We know who owns it. The Irish and Fenian Republican Brotherhood owned all these symbols. That's yes. their, their name is on it. And yes, the Free State won't recognize the, uh, 
the Irish Republican Brotherhood. It's so and they don't recognize the complicated. Government. It's so sad. It is sad. Because we I have a wonderful, wonderful independent nation. We would indeed. It's shocking to see it. And it, there's no... <clears throat> look, the conflict is between... Is, is that 1918-32 county election. Yes. That's the conflict between the Sovereign Republic of Air and Britain. Yes. <laughs> and King uh, George V, he wouldn't recognize the legitimacy, the legitimacy of the 1918-32 county election that we won 73 seats. And it's still there today. It's still there. Sure, it's on record. It. Yes, it's there. And how is it that no, you never see a politician, you never see RTE, you never see a historian <laughs> no. referring to it? What are they talking about? We have a 32 county. That you ha if Europe comes out in the morning and says, Ireland, where's your sovereignty? They're not able to say it. And in the first sovereign Dáil Éireann government, all those elected TDs yes. had to give their oath of allegiance to the state, the sovereign republic of Éireann, the sovereign Dáil Éireann government, the sovereign Dáil Éireann courts, the four courts, the war of independence <coughs> as a defence force, and, and be accountable to the sovereign people. They don't do that today. They just give a, a, a declaration to get paid their salaries, their pensions and their expenses. That is scandalous. There's no other country doing that. No, there isn't. That's corruption. No. And they should not should not be tolerated today. And in Europe, you saw Mairead McGuinness. She took the oath of allegiance in Europe because she couldn't sit in Europe. Uh, uh, but she won't take it here. Yes. And she There's should be terrible, asked why. Um, and all those in Leinster misgiving House... Misgiving about this whole area. Well, there. Leinster House was purchased uh, the, for the Free State. Yes. To impose the Free State, and that's what they did. And that's where it comes from. There is no place for that today. And people should know the truth. And Listen. you should question your, your, your politician. You should ask him, what oath of allegiance are you giving? Don't yes. go into court unless you say to the judge, I want to see your license, please. Yes. And when you see, meet your politician, I want to see your license. They don't have it. They don't have or it. when the guard stops you on the road, can you show me your license, please? You are the sovereign. And that's what, it, it, you know, people have to, it has to come out now. If we don't come out now... It's starting now. The conversation worldwide has started, Billy. I hope it is. And it is. It we is. don't want another hundred years. The IRB do not want another hundred years of propaganda lies, deception and fraud. No. We want a good government managed, look, and we can easily do it. Yes. We have a wonderful country. And we'll have a country that we can enjoy and we can understand. Well, we're entitled to enjoy. And as the proclamation said, it's a sentence that stuck with me from getting to know you, Billy, and John and all of the other great people, the, 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 the very sentence, cherishing, cherishing all of its citizens that's, equally. That's Look up really Billy, really thank really. you so much indeed. Just and um, it, it is just magnificent, but thank you so much indeed. And we'll be talking to you again in the very, very near, well, very thank you, John, very near future. You're, you're, the, you're one of the few people that are even doing Well, I, I, I feel, I, I put it like this to you. Um, I feel more Irish <laughs> when I'm talking to you because I've learned so much from you, oh, well, you. in the last year and a half since I've got oh, to know you on the, the program. So well, well Please done to you. We yes, that we have. Land. Oh yes, we have to read that, John. Well, we do that in another part, but just, just at the moment. Uh, thank you, Billy. And that's it from What Matters Programme. Part 3 is on the way. And I'm here in Esquiton in County Limerick. So from Billy Maguire, myself, John Prendergast, on behalf of Lear Media TV, Gordon Mielhamogat, August Sloan.